see. Well, I think it's out everywhere now, including the legislative assemblies where people are watching. <laughs> I, I think it's always been out. We are not a billion plus people for nothing. And uh, in our society, I think we have uh, very, very, uh, very well understood, very subterranean rules with regard to all of this. It happens all the time, nobody talks about it. Uh, suddenly you have a few authors writing about it. You've had authors writing about it, you've had music, you've had poetry, you've had temples. Uh, you've had it all the time. It's just that today we decided to discuss it here. But it's, uh, I think it's always been out there. So it's becoming, yeah. like, people are also becoming more... It's just the mediums have multiplied. Yeah. But uh, as I said, not, nobody's here out of immaculate conception. Everybody's here because of a certain reason. I like the line, you know, we're not billion plus for nothing. We really know a thing or two about it, a billion thing or two about it. But of course, we become a little more acceptable. What do you think? Yeah, I think the entire society has come out and they have started. We have, we all have started accepting a lot of things. Things which were taboo at one point in time to even to discuss about that. We have opened up, and it's just not sex, it's about n number of things that we have accepted. Sex is one part of it. Definitely, we are, after China, we are the second populated country. We definitely, we should talk about the source of it, how we are actually growing. It's a, it's a taboo to talk about the source of it, on one hand. Uh, but I think, the, as, a, as a society, uh, we have accepted. My only point is that it's a double-edged sword. On, on one hand, we have started accepting it. On the other hand, we see, you know, things going out of our way. The, the generation is, is getting, you know, adulthood is, re uh, is reaching adulthood so soon in their life in comparison to what it was at least a decade ago or two decades back. So I see other two, two, you know, a sword with two edges. Okay, maybe but just taking a leave from him. Uh, it's, do you think it's a, a little, let's say, dynamic? Because what he's saying right now, ki abhi zada ho gaya hai, you know, uh, people are like talking about it, but the generation gap. But that generation gap, do you think was always there? Like, even the people who were born in, let's say, 60s, they would say ki, jo humse pehle hai, they were not really open about it. We are a little, more, little bit more open about it. The people in 70s, they said, like, you know, the people born in 50s were not really cool about it. So, was it always there, do you think? I think that, uh, uh, in fact, the generation of the 70s think that we are very conservative. I mean, they really had a swinging life, a lot of them. And they, I have found so many people, uh, that generation telling me that you know, you all are nothing, you should have seen us when we were your age. I mean, we really had it good and things like that. So it depends on who you talk to and uh, where they're at in their life. And I find actually people are um, more conservative now than they used to be.